Hurry up. Man, not even worth picking up. Ugh. Oh, man, I'm so stressed. I don't want the Emperor... I don't want the fucking Reaper to show up. Oh, man. No, 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 no. I don't want to fight him. I don't want to fight him. You bet I'll sacrifice your asses. I won't even think twice about it. Ooh. Girl, they almost got us. Here, let me despawn this guy so you guys don't encounter him. Stairs. Good. Please hold on to this. Obtain Sword Breaker. Yeah, we can make Chernobog, but, like, why would I? He does get Megidula, but, like, I would need to have Moon maxed out for him to get that shit. And like I said, Loki's gonna get Migidula like right now. Please spread out and search the area. This may be useful. I'll take it with me. Okay, so I found the access point. No. Okay. I'll keep looking around then. Great, let's get going. Sweet. Here's what I found. Bead. That's actually a pretty nice find. <sighs> so is it going to be another three dudes, or what's going to happen here? Three enemies in the middle. Okay, so it's another three, three guys. So let me save again. Dang, this shit is hella long, huh? I mean, that's nice of them that they put, like, so many warp points, because if I had to go up like 20 floors without a warp, that shit would suck. Okay, should I make those dudes now? I mean, I could. I can't make Odin, which sucks. I could make Byako. Zyodyne, Mind Charge, and Growth 2. Dionysus, Shisa, and Suzaku. Like, pulling out Suzaku is going to be freaking expensive, man. I don't know if it's worth it. Loki is Dekarabia, Ose, and Orpheus. And it sucks. I didn't save my Dekarabia when I made him last time. Let's see. He was level 50. How did I make him again? He comes with... It was Ose, Legion, and Slime. He automatically gets Megiddo. Growth 2, Fire Boot. I mean, I don't really want those skills on him. I don't even know what Loki gets in terms... Well, I mean, I might be able to check. I might have wrote it down. Written it down. I might have written it down. He gets Bufudine, Garudine, Megidula, Nullfire. He's going to get three levels, so he's going to definitely get Megidula. Bufudine and Garudine, huh? Can I make him out of Pazuzu? Even though I have plans to use Pazuzu in somebody else. I have plans to use Pazuzu in Jatayu. Mm. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Bufudine, Garudine, Megudula, Nullfire. Like, maybe I could make him out of Parvati. Or just as he comes, I guess. I don't have to. But my Osa definitely should have Growth 2 on him. So I'll, I'll definitely put Growth 2 on Loki. It's weird, man. These full dudes are like... They're designed to be like... You can put any skill you want on them. They have an equal chance of inheriting all skills. Like, there are some dudes that are like pre... Uh, exposed to like inheriting wind or pre exposed to inheriting light, but like full dudes. Um, I need to get rid of two of these dudes in my party. Um, personas of the full arcana, I call them Omni just because they can inherit all the skills. 
dark, light, debuff, buff, heal, whatever you want them to, pretty much. Narasimha. Mediarama, Mind Charge, Megarula. Fatal End, Evade Wind. Don't know that number, sorry. If it's important, you'll leave a message. Like Parvati and Kaiwan at this point are just taking up space, man. Like, he would be nice against things that are, like, susceptible to any kind of thing. Like, any kind of debuff, but I haven't encountered many of them. Three, six, nine, so I have space for three. Oh, this shit's gonna be pricey. Let me save real quick. Just to be safe. But yeah, my first dude to have Megidola. That's pretty cool. Almighty skills seem really cool on paper. But like, they're hella expensive. And if you don't have high magic, they don't do any damage. Like, at least I learned that with Megiddo. It's like, ooh, 130 damage of unmitigated, you know. It's unblockable, but it's like, well... The dudes have a lot of health, so... Even if it is unblockable, it's kind of like, uh... The only one worth using is Armageddon, and that shit's, like, really hard to get. Um, okay, so I saved. We're doing, uh, Loki. Welcome to the Velvet Room. How may I help you today? Um, Compendium. Oh, 75k. <coughs> So Orf so Decarabia, Osa, and Orpheus. So what, what did you have on you, my man? Stagnant Air, Matarunda, and Megiddo. God, he's a nightmare fuel. Oh, I got a pain in the pit of me wallet. Osa, mine should have growth too. Like this one actually handcrafted, so he's uh I mean ignore Mabufu and Moragion. Growth 2 is definitely what I'm going to want. The hard part is, is like fucking... He can inherit anything, so... Didn't really have a plan for... What his skills were going to look like. I just knew that he gets Megidola. But he also does get Bufudine and Garudan. Dekarabia, Ose. So I for sure want growth too. Apt pupil, Garudan, and Bufudan. I mean, that's nice. Less chance to be crit, it's always nice. Growth too, Bash, Matarunda, Bewildered. I guess I should have just taken it, right? But we could, like, maybe get growth too, stagnant air, and maybe some kind of debuff. Growth too, stagnant air, Poisma, and Bash, or why not? Like, I could have put Megiddo on him if I really wanted to try, but he's getting Megiddo. I'm Loki, ready for action. Oh, okay. You're... How very, uh, uninteresting. So he does have a decent chunk of magic. If it was possible, I should have tried to, like, get, like, um... Mind charge or something. Like, if I had really taken the time to, like, think about it, I could have made him with mind charge and something else. Like, mind charge, growth 2, and Megidula probably would have been decent. But it's fine, it's fine. I don't know how much I'm gonna use him. To be frank. Not bad, not bad. Null fire, because he's weak against it, so... He drains wind, strong against ice, strong against dark. 
The compendium has been upgraded. I mean, updated. They are now registered. So we'll see how it looks in battle, shall we? It's probably not going to do that much. Oh, hopefully these next three dudes aren't really annoying. Please explore as much of Tartarus as you can. I'll try. Oh, let me check everybody's status. Like, what is everybody's level? 52, 57, 50, 49, 50, 50, 52, 50. So, who was still 49? Ken. I think Ken was 49. Yeah, so Ken, maybe I can move um, you out of the party. I don't think that's a wise decision. Yeah, well, I don't care what you think, now do I. Okay, so I... We have two lightning resists. I don't want that mistake again. I mean, Ken and Akihiko kind of do the same thing, but... Ken has Hama skills. Let me remove you from the party. It's nice to have, like, people who are... Opposites of each other. Now, I could bring in the dog. So, let's bring in the dog, then. And I think I got a weapon for him at some point. No, not remove from party. Uh, you can just mash A here, because it... Remove is the second option for some reason. Sword, woo! <laughs> nice upgrade, my boy. Good boy. Restores a bit of HP every turn, whatever. Sigma Drive, lowers chance of sustaining a crit. That's nice. Kunamoto seems happy. Okay, so hopefully it's not something that does wind damage, because then Akihiko is going to be knocked on his ass. Don't know what to expect. Hopefully it doesn't do fire damage, because then my ass is going to be knocked down. We shall see. Oh, dropped frames. Sorry about that at some point. My internet. Yeah, I took a nosedive. And since three enemies... Oh, good luck. Be ready. I sense it's a strong one. Looks pretty strong. Fifty damage, huh? So this dude doesn't even have like AOE, like lowering spells. Okay, they're highly resistant to fire. Hang in there. The Gigantic fist. So I'm guessing these dudes mighty swing. Right? They must be super resistant to slash and shit, huh? What if we not try it on them? Who's the weakest one? They're all kind of equally weak. Loki! Ooh, they're hella resistant to wind. They're resistant to wind, resistant to fire. Deathbound. Hang in there. Of course. <gasps> so 
So Tempest Slash can one shot her if both hits hit. I've regained my honor. Well, this is a shit show. I should have made Ganish. The dude has high counter. I forgot to make him. It's nothing but AoE melee skills. Like, what a fucking piece of shit. Okay, they take regular damage from Ice and Almighty. I'm guessing these dudes block all kinds of fucking moves. Melee moves. These dudes are just fucking annoying. Pardon my French. It's like this shit is just like designed to be annoying shit. They take full damage from ice. That's about it. Mm. There's probably a trick to them. Like, oh, they're super... Susceptible to fear, or they're super susceptible to something else. Ugh, how annoying. Either they reflect, or they probably don't take any damage from fucking... Slash attacks, right? Or they have really high dodge up, they block. They block all physical attacks. Who didn't see this shit coming? They do all pierce, they do slash, they do strike, they have power charge, so I gotta use magic on them, and it takes for freaking ever. And they have AoE spells. They can crit, and will crit, because of course they do. Charm doesn't work. Here comes the gigantic fist. Wow. Virus Breath probably doesn't work because it never works on these fucking bosses. Oh, it does work on them. Kind of. Interesting. Well, it's not going to. I'm gonna have to think of a stupid strategy for this bullshit because they block all physical and only take <coughs> full damage from fucking... I didn't test electric damage, but they only take full damage from ice... And almighty. Oh, what a pain in my butt, man. These stupid bosses are so cheaply designed. Ganesh! How do I make you? Kali, Thoth, and Saki Mitama. Oh, man. How aggravating. Dudes like this are so cheap. I deal piss poor damage to them, and meanwhile they can one shot my entire group with their stupid AoE skills. <coughs> Thoth and Saki Mitama. Like, why? So, Saki Mitama was, uh. lovers, I think. And Thoth is a uh, hero font. Which is up here. Super susceptible to fear, maybe. He's my little monkey man. Oh my goodness. 
So, Virus Breath can work on them, but it's only 25% of current health. Maybe I can try doing that at the beginning. Uh, Kali, Saki Mitama, Thoth, Ganesh. Counter, Growth 2. So I need... He has Death Bound already and Power Charge. But I, what I want is Growth 2 and Apt Pupil for sure. Growth 2, Apt Pupil, and Revolution would be... Ideal. I am Ganesh. Growth 2. Apt Pupil. Come on. Growth 2. Apt Pupil. And Revolution. And maybe Counter as a fourth, but that's asking a lot. Apt Pupil. Growth 2. Counter. No revolution, though. Oh, man. Because he's going to get count like high counter. I don't know when, but he's going to get it. Probably, what, at 63? I'm not going to be able to even get it on him. He gets high counter at 62, so we would need to have 8 in the star social link for him to get high counter. Which is nice, it's 50%. So in a perfect world, it would be Apt Pupil, Revolution, Growth 2, Encounter. Like, I could maybe do without Revolution. I don't know, man. It's such a good skill. Revolution, growth to... It would be nice. Be nice, but asking for all four skills is, like, unrealistic. Growth to counter revolution. Damn, if only that was apt to pull. Like, Apt Pupil is a must to carry over onto these these melee dudes. Because that doubles your crit chance. And anytime any of these dudes gets death bound, you want to also carry that shit over. Because that has 25% crit chance just, on, just by itself. Ganesh, Apt Pupil, Counter, Revolution, and Growth 2. Growth 2, Counter, Apt Pupil, Counter, Apt Pupil, Revolution, Growth 2, Apt Pupil, Counter, Blade of Fury, like, I might have to give up on Revolution. I don't want to, but I might have to. Like, having growth on these dudes is really nice. Although, nothing is better than Growth 3, in my opinion. I mean, nothing, it's not in my opinion, it's just an objective truth. Like, fucking Growth 3 is full experience whenever they're not in the party. Don't know why I said that. <laughs> kind of just letting uh, my stream of consciousness flow out of my mouth from my brain. <sighs> I really don't want to say yes to getting rid of Revolution, though. Drains, wind, and blocks Mudo. 
counter sharp student revolution. Putting revolution would be a bad idea in this next fight anyway, because those dudes would fucking rock our socks off. Especially since they know deathbound and like deathbound doesn't work on them because of course it doesn't. So you just gotta hit them with your pissy little fucking ice and wind attacks or your ice and pretty much just your ice attacks. I didn't check to see how much thunder does. Apt pupil counter. Growth to apt pupil. Growth to counter. Growth to counter. Apt pupil. Growth to counter. Growth to apt pupil counter. Growth to Growth to apt pupil Apt pupil counter Growth to counter Oh, this shit takes so long Herculean strike So, instead of bringing the dog, I might have to bring Mitsuru. I might have to bring in Junpei for his... The way that he's able to... Debuff them and buff us. It's like, now I'm getting all this shit, man. I don't want all these stupid... <sighs> I should have just been happy with those three. Now it's going to take me forever to come back around to them. Growth to counter revolution, so close. But I want apt pupil and growth two at the very least. And counter. Because I figured it'd be really helpful in this one, even though it doesn't matter, because it's not going to actually stop them. It's not going to. They're not going to take damage from it. Is what I'm trying to say. It'll stop me from taking damage, but... Oh man, I should've just settled. I hate this system so much. It just takes so long. Growth to app tuple counter revolution. Fucking sweet dudes. It only took us like 15 minutes, but we got it. All four skills. Oh my god. Please don't mess up. Like, don't fuck me over on this dude. I am Ganesh. I was born of thee, and I shall walk by thy side. Only three levels. It's such a shame. Magaru dying for whatever reason. 
Don't know why this dude has wind attacks. It doesn't make any sense. But with growth too, he'll eventually learn high counter. It doesn't really matter though, because he's not going to really help me in the next in the next fight. Oh, let me save though.